What's going on guys? Welcome to Sonic Sons and today I want to talk about mastering and specifically I want to talk about a plugin called U Lean Loudness Meter. Now if that's the plugin you see that's running in the back and the amazing thing about this plugin is it either runs as a plugin into your DAW or it runs as an independent application. So if you want to try out some other songs that are out there and see what their meter readings are, you can do that as well. And the pro version of this plugin also offers some additional functionality. We have the plugin right here and you can see I'm using the pro version. There's a free version that looks exactly the same. However, it doesn't have a lot of the features like online streaming presets that get updated as well as being able to export the image of what you are seeing right here. So let's play this and we are going to uh, set it to Spotify. So it's looking at the readings that Spotify usually targets for, which is negative 14 integrated loudness. So let's play this. <laughs> Now you can see that my song is gonna get reduced in volume by Spotify right here to hit that negative 14 mark. Now if you go and listen to this song on Spotify, it actually does have an issue where the song fluctuates in energy on Spotify. However, you can also see the dynamic range here and you can see that you know this is kind of the range that you would want anything over it does not sound compressed if it's too underneath it it's going to sound like a squashed record so uh, one of the great features of the paid version of the plugin is you can just bring an audio file into this and it will analyze everything for you as it's completed you can see as you zoom in how the song fluctuates throughout the track and again this is where I'm seeing that the song sounds super compressed towards the end and here it's, it has a lot of dynamic range it's not being as compressed throughout but here it's absolutely being squashed. You can use a lot of these visual cues to make adjustment while you're mastering. Now this is already a master track so I'm not going to be able to do much except just to reduce the volume here to get to that level. Now there's also a bunch of different things that are available here. You can kind of go back to your normal mode. If you go here it will show the momentary change right here in the loudness as you zoom into this and then you can disable that. You can see the true peak right here as well. This is probably one of the most accurate meters that I've used. It's so simple to use and it, you know, it's resizable. You can change the modes here. You can hide and show things. Uh, you can change it to focus. What do you want to, you want it to focus on integrated loudness, loudness range, dynamic range, uh, integrated is how we perceive loudness. So that's what you would want to do. You can scale the GUI, uh, you know, how often you want it to refresh. You can do that right here as well. So that was Ulean loudness meter. And as you can see, this is a great plugin and a great alternative to some of the other things that are out there that have some functionality, but not all. And this kind of encompasses everything you need in one place and it's free and you can also get their paid version. So as usual, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. And if you like the content, make sure you hit the like and the subscribe button. I'll see you at the next one.